A high school football legend from Colleen, Tommy Harris was an All-American defensive lineman at OU. He played for Bob Stoops, Brent Venables. You got to play with Dusty Dvorak, oh, yeah. uh, Teddy Lehman, all those guys. Oh yeah, Teddy Lehman, Rocky Cowmans, Roy Williams, the real Roy Williams. Yeah, real. You know what I'm saying? Like no offense to my boy Roy that played in the Orange team, but you know we we had some ballers, man. Josh Heupel, uh, just uh, some some real guys that. That just made a difference in it. Look who won the who won the Heisman this year. Yeah, and OU and Did Baker they come Mayfield. out of? Oh, I uh, thought it was Baker Mayfield. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but we are from Texas. Yeah, yeah. Right? <laughs> <laughs> the best was come from Texas. Right? Tommy was a first round draft choice by the Bears in 2004 and became a three time Pro Bowler. Right up the middle again is Tommy Harris. Harris's final season in the NFL was in 2011 and was prepared for the next step in his life. He married the love of his life, Ashley, the mother of his son and daughter, Tyson and Tinsley. 41 days later, Tommy lost Ashley due to complications from a brain aneurysm. Tommy referred to this as his greatest loss, but has since become a motivational speaker. But I just want to take advantage of this moment. Um, about five years ago, I lost my wife to a brain aneurysm. And uh, I remember sitting in the same auditor in the auditorium just like you were. We were in Indianapolis, and me and her were sitting here, and I was watching a man come up there also and talk about how he lost his wife. And as I was sitting there in the audience, I was only married for 30 days at that moment. And I didn't know 11 days later I would lose my wife. Unfortunately, you went through the... The, the tragedy of losing your wife yeah. and a lot of us lose significant people in our lives but me personally the way you have turned that into a life-changing experience for yes, you and other people just watching from afar mm -hmm. it's pretty powerful stuff yes sir I, I just want everyone to know that they can make it no matter what tragic event whatever you're going through to know that you're going through and to teach them that how do you grow through this don't just go through something let it grow you let it mature you, let it turn you into something. So I think I'm just a voice to telling people that are going through difficult times, are going through hard times, that you can make it. No matter what you're doing, yeah, it's different, it's scary, it's hard, but you can make it, whatever it is. So that's just what, that's what I go and I help with. Because I realize that death is a thing that happens in life. It's not a thing that happens to life. So my job is to go and tell everyone that is living to make life count. Tommy Harris has done just that, honoring his late wife as a loving father and traveling the world to deliver his inspirational message. Thank you. What is it that you learned from that, the loss of your wife about not only her health, about love, and about life in general? I just learned from that uh, that no one dies, they only finish. I got that life goes on, the energy never dies, it only transfers, that whatever she did in her life that she meant to me, that I just, when she left, when she finished, I took that on in my life and now I use that energy to make a difference. So if anyone's going through grieving or loss or, or anything, that no one dies, they finish. We have a finish line that we don't choose, but it's there. And our job is to run our hardest every day we get up and to finish strong. And when those are finished, they encourage and inspire you to do it. Exactly. So I'm telling to all the ones that are still running, keep running your hardest, brother, and make a difference in this race. What is the Tommy Harris doing? Now, you're a father. Yeah. And you you have your hands on in a bunch of business ventures, is that correct? Yes, I, I do a lot of different venture capitalists. Uh, they call it a serial entrepreneur. No. That's what they, after football, you gotta learn all these yeah, new yeah. terms. Like, what am I gonna do now? Like, <laughs> so I'm a serial entrepreneur, I think. Um, I have a boxing gym in Georgetown. I'm writing a book, I speak around the world. I, I'm just figuring it out, man. Just trying to enjoy it, ride the wave, bro. Off camera, we were just talking about something that has changed my life, and that is the, the, the Bikram yoga. Yes. And you take part in that as well. Yeah, so what I've been working on something right now, it's called Broga. So it's brother yoga. Wow. So number men, and they come and they open up and teach them how to open up. Um, it changed my life. That's how I lost 77 pounds. Unbelievable. Yeah, through yoga, through breathing, through life. You know what it does. Yeah. It, it brings it. Stay on your mat. Mind, body, soul. Stay on the mat. Stay on the mat. Oh, Focus man. on that breath. That's it, man. That's life. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> 
Don't be shocked if you see Harris in and around Austin delivering that positive energy to places like Barton Springs Pool. Sean Clinch, KVU Sports.